half. We'll see what happens. And a kill by Jared. Spinning. And now a block in the middle by Kaylee Duncan. Now Avon in the middle. Clinton, Clinton through the block. Hit it in the middle for Duncan. Duncan with a kill. And put away. Stewart will go with Brangioni again. Another block by Butler. Carly Clinton. Set for Bajule. Fanya with a big time shot. Can retro serve. And it's a service ace off the hands of Brangioni. And now blocked by Bajule. Wiley blocked. Oh. Duncan now left at the net, and Duncan puts it away. Sets it behind her for Benning. Jared off the hands, the block gets the kill to go down. Here's, in. Here's Duncan getting the kill. Bink with the kill, with the kill. hard block. Blocked by Here's big serving. And it's a service ace. And a block. Here's by Retro. They were setting for Fink. Ivy hits it through the block. Jaren Benning hits it. Hard. Butler got it back across. Now Slay and Clark is blocked. Jule with the kill! The Grizzlies are headed to the national tournament. They are district champions, region champions to go along with their conference championship. They pile in the middle of the floor. What a great moment for the Butler volleyball team with their fourth year head coach, Lisa Lechtenberg. The Grizzlies have been dominant all season long and they continue to be so here, getting a straight set victory over the Seward County Saints. The Butler Grizzlies headed to the national tournament for the first time in program history. Looking back from my freshman year and just the way that this program has grown in these three years that I've been here and the four years that Cosby and Lechtenberg have been here, I just, ooh, makes me a little emotional to do that. But um, they're just great. It's great. What a great moment for Butler Volleyball, the Grizzlies, with their first ever Region 6 championship, and they are headed to the national tournament in Hutchinson, and it's been a fun ride to be on. Thanks for tuning in.